friends in this video we are going to use of rank function how to use rank function efficiently we will see this and we will use the same schema market star schema if uh, all of you possibly will be using the same uh, will be having the schema but if you don't have then you can download it from description box box link and you can use so till now we have uh, we have used top 3 customer top 3 viewer few examples of top things so now let's try to make use of rank for some kind of information we will try to rank all the sales based on their order id in the descending order so where we want to understand the ones which highest sell should be on the top. So how do we get this? So for this we need to query market fact pool because that is the table where all the information is there in market fact pool related to sales. So we will go to the market fact pool and we will see the columns and we will see the values here. So, what is going to happen? We will do first, we will see the information of order ID and sales because sales will be a decimal value. So, what we will do, we will do round sales because it's a decimal value. So, what we are going to use we are to see the sales as rounded sales we will do select order id and sales as rounded sales as is for better use of better view of the column we are using column alias so we are using as here is the keyword so we can see there are few order id and the sales is rounded now okay now sales is rounded we will see the name of the customer who is having maximum sales or we can have any uh, we can have here information of customer by uh, by uh, decreasing the, by removing dsc1 and we can have a uh, we can see the name of customer. So on any customer you really want, you can see the sales detail or order detail of that customer and you can rank that customer order in the way you really want. So first of all, we want to uh, see the customer name with order ID. If we want to see the customer name with order ID, because in market factful, there is no information about customer name you can see here so we need to join some another table which is named as customer dimension below okay maybe it's there customer name and we can have the name of customer from there here is the in cust dimension here is the name of customer so we have to join both the tables on inner basis on customer id so we can see the name of customer and we can uh, use the rank function on that particular customer order. So what we are going to do here, if we are using select customer name, order name from market factful for the simplified, simplified use, we should use table name as table alias, market factful as M, inner joint table two as C, on link field, this M dot cust ID is equal to this order by customer name DSC because we want the top one customer we want to see the name of custom so there are various customers but what we what we want to see we just want to see the record of Aaron Hawkins on the basis of their order I hope you are very familiar till now with this. What is the use of order by? What is the use of link field? And how we are using inner join? So we are using inner join customer ID. The link field is customer ID from two tables. Customer 
dimension and market factful and we are uh, putting the result by order by customer name and that on the top of the uh, table there will be the name of the customer who is having maximum order so now you see the use of rank function see we want to uh, use the this is how we will use the rank function so what we will do here we want to see the customer name rm hawkins as order of rm hawkins as in descending order as sales rank in descending order but to every order there should be a rank to every order there should be a rank in descending order so what we are going to do we are using inner join in where close with where close we are using inner join with two table market fact because this is having information about order id and customer dimension because it will have the information about customer name so we will join inner join two tables on link field where uh, filter name is this and now we will see how to use rank so select customer name order id the attribute we want to show rounded sales we will round the sales as rounded sales comma rank over over which uh, attribute you want to rank rank over within bracket order by i will uh, go through some more examples in more detail order by uh, or whatever so here order by sales descending so rank over over a close over a close rank over order by condition on sales descending as and we will put all this condition as sales rank so this is how we can use rank to get the relative rank in a table now you will see the practical applicability of how sales in descending order and sales rank is provided here this is how we can use rank to get the rank of various report to get the relative ranks of various records in a table now we are going to run this then you can see rm hawkins which is having uh, 4072 sales on that particular order id is ranked one similarly where rm hawkins uh, is decreasing order quantity sales quantity rank is going to be increased so in descending order the, uh, the top one order have rank 1 top second order have rank 2 top seventh order have rank 7 so we have ranked the all values there order by rn hawkins from first to the n whatever the value he is ranked so this is the practical applicability of rank function so it doesn't have any limitation like order by close uh, like basic queries we have seen so far so then you can understand how beautifully we can use rank function with join uh, to get the information from multiple tables now if we want to see that top eight sales order from a customer who is custom and hockey we are taking here same customer but if you want to see some another customer we can see select rank and for edge sorry with rank and for as we are uh, is uh, uh, seeing a common table expression rank and for as result of this will be used so with rank and for this is a common table expression as result of this one query so we are using here sub query so this sub query will execute it and result of this will be shown as a uh, part of query and this one query second select rank from this is sales rank is this so this will this require this part of query will use result of this so this is the same query we have put it here as a sub query and with we have used common table expression with rank info as customer name same this is oh, so same all completely same and we are using it here as a sub query so the result of this sub query will be here as common table expression 
and you can use select star from rank info where sales rank is greater than or equal to small than or equal to 8. So if you are going to run this one query what it is going to show it will show the top 8 order by customer RM Hawkins in the rank. So you can easily see that like uh, previous examples of descending ascending here is not any kind of problem here. So if we are using order by sales descending as sales rank we can also if we are going to see what it is going to happen. We are not using descending here. Then see what what will be the result. Minimum sale will be ranked as 1. Okay. Minimum sales ranked as 1 because we are when we are not mentioning this DSC, then it will take automatically as ascending. So this is the beauty of rank function. See what we can do. We can select another one customer. We can see who is the second one customer. So Aaron Hawkins is the first one customer and the second one customer is here. Aaron Bergman. So we can uh, put the query on this one too. Aaron Bergman. So this is the beauty uh, of rank. It can it will rank everything about or some customer everything over you mentioned in overviews. Everything over the condition you are mentioning in overviews. So now I have changed the name of customer. Then we can see the result. See, it is showing. It's have only seven orders, so it is showing only seven. So we have not used descending here, so it is not. It is showing in ascending order by its own order by sales. If we are putting here, then we can see the uh, changes in result. So. See what is going to be here. The result will be there in descending. See. So I hope you understood. We can how we can use rank function with common table expression, with filter, with joins, and what is the beauty of rank function? We here we uh, don't need to be restriction of top five, top of ten. If there is hundred things uh, here. For that particular customer, for that, uh, we, for the filter condition we want to use, then it will rank one to thousand values. It will work up to lakhs value. So here we don't have any kind of restrictions, so that we can't we can't see much higher values, much lengthy values. I hope you understood how to use rank function, how to use joins with rank function, how to use common table expression with rank function, how to use over clause here or within with some condition with a over by and how to use rank. Okay, thank you. Thank you so much. If you have any kind of uh, doubt, please let me know and please go for more and more practice. Thank you friends. Thank you so much. Thank you.